Hi, Hiking Plus here with a new gear list for our 2016 uh, through hike of the Dobson Trail. First of all, we're going to check out the items that we have on the pack itself. And we're going to be bringing along a Spot GPS, which is a, a device that can send SOS signals, but it can also uh, allow you to uh, keep in touch with your uh, loved ones at home. Uh, we are also going to be bringing along two Gatorade bottles, two disposable bottles. We're not going to be going with the Nalgene bottles. These are lighter. Uh, also on this little mesh pocket, we're going to be bringing our rain gear, which is a North Face uh, rain jacket. And we're also going to be bringing our camp shoes and also river crossing shoes, which are the uh, just a pair of Crocs. Uh, if we flip the bag over, we have on here a uh, whistle with a carabiner. Uh, the whistle is for emergency use, but the carabiner is also used uh, in conjunction with our bear hang. So this has a double purpose. Uh, in these little po side pockets, we have our GPS to keep track of where we're going. We have a pack of tissue and on the other side we also have another pack of tissue and also our uh, bug spray which is Pi Active. It's uh, exempt of DEET. Let's turn the bag over again. If we take a look at the inside pocket here, the top pocket, we have our Purification method, which is the Stary Pen Traveler. We have our compass in case our GPS fails, which is a Sunto Global Compass. We also have in here our rain cover for our backpack. Further in here we have our beanie, which is a merino wool icebreaker uh, beanie. We have our med kit, which is uh, ibuprofen, uh, anti-nausea, uh, plasters, etc. We have our toilet paper. We have our hygiene kit which is Purell and wet wipes. We also have in here our buff, which is also made by Icebreaker and it is merino wool. That's that for that pocket. If we go underneath that pocket, in the mesh one, we have our uh, scrubby, or our uh, chamois actually, which is made for our, our pots. We have a net, just in case the bugs get pretty bad. We have a uh, spoon for cooking, which is a uh, Cedar Summit spoon. We have our Princeton Tech bite uh, uh, for our headlamp. We have a Sharpie. We have our bear bag hang cord. We have our other hygiene kit, which is uh, our toothbrush, uh, toothpaste, repair kit, uh, and another uh, chamois, and this one is meant for uh, cleaning ourselves. And finally in that pocket we have some extra batteries for our uh, GPS, for our spot, and also for our headlamp. If we take off this 8 liter bag, we have inside here one of our layers in case it gets cold. It's a Eddie Bauer uh, First Ascent uh, Primal Off uh, jacket. And in hot inside here we have our specialist uh, See the Summit tent which we have added also a ground sheet. Uh, it has the stakes in here but it does not have the uh, poles. We're going to be using the trekking poles as our uh, to set up the tent. If we move on inside the bag, 
we have another extra layer of warmth, which is an Eddie Bauer fleece. We have our cook kit, which is the GSI Minimalist, and then we've added on the bottom for our cup a cup that comes with the GSI uh, Pinnacle. Inside here we have uh, Scrubby, we have our soap, we have the MSR Micro, we have the uh, our fuel, and then underneath we have the uh, pot grabber. So that sums up the uh, cook kit. Inside here we have our Sea to Summit 4 liter bag which we use for our pillow. And inside this bag we have our uh, gloves just in case it gets cold. We have our Sea to Summit Extreme Reactor Liner which adds 15 degrees Celsius to our sleeping bag. We have also a pair of uh, extra socks and also these socks are used uh, for sleeping. We have our food bag which is here we have two days worth of food. The trail itself is only three days so we're going to be camping out for two nights. And then uh, in here we have our long johns which is the ice breaker uh, thermal top and the ice breaker thermal bottom. We also have our sleeping pad, which is the Neo Air, uh, Termarest Neo Air. And then finally, the last item that we have in the bag is our uh, sleeping bag, which is inside another 8 liter bag. It's the Mountain Hardware Ratio 32, which is rated for 0 degrees. Down here is the temperature during summer. They don't get that cold, but it, it can get a bit cold. So if it gets that cold, we all we have our extra liner, which the liner also works as protecting the bag since this is a down bag and you don't want to want to get it wet. So yeah, that's the uh, ratio 32. So for those who have liked the page Hiking Plus, uh, this is pretty lighter than what you guys have seen on the uh, article that I've wrote. So this is, this whole kit weighs in at a base weight of 12 pounds and then uh, the added weight of food and water brings this kit at around 25 pounds. So we're going to be going in much lighter this time than the previous times we've hiked the trails. So thanks for watching uh, the gear list uh, for 2016. Uh, if you haven't subscribed to our YouTube channel, please subscribe. It's Hiking Plus NB. And if you want, you can also like our page, Hiking Plus, on Facebook.